crews are coming in to the Earl Warren Showgrounds in Santa Barbara to fight the Alisal fire west of the city along the Gaviota coastline. The fire is rapidly spreading in the brushland there. Strike teams are coming in from throughout Southern California, and now additional resources are coming in from the federal government. This incident is going to be expanded into a type one incident with 50 management personnel coming from the federal government to coordinate the resources on this fire. It's expanded in an area that's framed by the top of the mountain and about 2,000 to 3,000 feet up down to the Pacific Ocean. It's closed Highway 101 and thousands of vehicles have been relocated into mountain passes. And one of the goals today is to get Highway 101 protected from fire and reopen along with the Union Pacific Railroad tracks and that would restore Amtrak service as well. They're also going to be doing property assessment. A number of ranches have structure protection, but some of the buildings there, we understand, have been damaged, possibly destroyed. There'll be an update later on today. More than 150 wild animals have been uh, taken out of their corrals and brought to the Earl Warren showgrounds, including some sheep and goats in the area. The firefighters say this is going to be a long haul, possibly a three-week fire based on what they've seen in the past. There are some burn areas here from before, the Gap Fire and the Sherpa Fire some years back. And if the fire gets into those zones where there isn't as much new growth, it would likely slow down. They're hoping for winds to calm down and more air tankers and helicopters attacking with fire retardant and water later on today and the rest of the week. In Santa Barbara, I'm John Palmentary, Fox 11 Los Angeles News.